Some years ago, someone had the clever idea to establish an amazing new silk industry in the United States. So they brought in gypsy moths and they anticipated that the male gypsy moth would mate with the female gypsy moth and help to create this silk industry. But instead, the gypsy moths busied themselves eating all of our trees. They were going after the oak trees and they went after the maple trees and all the leaves were just delicious for them. So instead of creating a silk industry, they were busy consuming and having a good time. We were in a pretty disastrous situation in the United States. The scientists engaged in all kinds of research to try and figure out how to get rid of the gypsy moths. We gave up on the, on the silk industry. They created uh, various insecticides to spray to get rid of the moths, but that didn't do the job. Finally, somebody came up with a very creative erotic concept, and that was to have a synthetic but intense smells of the female moth put into little pellets. The male gypsy moth would seek after the smell of the female gypsy moth. It's mating time. The females are all fluttering around saying, choose me, choose me. And the male gypsy moths go into the area to mate, but the pellets that have that extensive smell of the female cause the male gypsy moths to float all around looking, looking, looking for their perfect mate. She's all over the place, but he's not finding her. Eventually they couldn't mate, they died because that's what he's looking for, is that smell that never, never equals what she's got. She has a reduced smell, a real smell, a natural smell for a gypsy moth. And he is now looking for that synthetic smell that has been created by the scientists. In essence, that's exactly what's been happening with pornography.